student one is a class and protected int age and public string name and protected method is here so it's a protected method so let's uh, let's um, read more about the introducing access control encapsulation links data with the code that manipulates it however encapsulation provide another important attribute is access control through encapsulation you can control what parts of program can assess the member of a class by controlling access you can prevent misuse for example allowing access to data only through a well defined set of methods you can prevent the misuse of that data thus when correctly implemented a class creates a black box which may be used but the inner workings of which are not open to tampering however the classes that were presented earlier do not completely meet this code so for example if we take the stack class shown uh, in um, stack class let's see the example of stack class in you already done this program in r in the, in the previous topic so stack it's not showing so don't worry so here is uh, for example if we, if we are taking the stack class shown uh, so what is it what is it true that the method push and pop to to provide a control interface to the stack so this interface is not enforced that it is possible for another part of the program bypass these methods so assess the stack directly of course in the wrong hands this could be led to trouble so in this section you will introduce to the mechanism by which you can precisely control the access to the various members of the class so how a member can be assessed is determined by the assess modifier attached to its declaration you can see the program in our video java tutorial number 18 where we are dis we discuss about the stack so java supply a rich set of assess modifiers some aspects of assess control are are related mostly to inheritance or packages a package is essentially a grouping of class this part of java assess control mechanism will discussed in our coming videos here let's begin by examining assess control as it applied to a single class once you understand the fundamental of assess control the rest will be easy so java assess modifiers are public private and protected so java also defines a default assess level protected applies only when inheritance is involved so we use uh, protected only when inheritance is involved so java also defines a default access level so let's begin defining public and private when member of class is modified by public so then that member can be assessed by any other code when a member of class is specified as private then that member can only assess by other member of its class now you can understand the main has always been preceded by the public modifier so it is called by the code that is outside the program that is by the java runtime system when no assess modifier is used then by default the member of class is public within its own package but cannot be assessed outside of its packages so we will uh, read more about the packages in our coming videos and now we are discussing about public private public you are already seeing uh, anyone can assess outside the program and in protected i already told you about that protected and private can only be assessed by other member of its class okay and protected applies only when inheritance in involved jab inheritance involved okay tabhi then it is called by code that uh, that is outside the program that is by the java runtime system when no assess modifiers is used then by default the member of class is public its own package but cannot be assessed outside of its package so in this class this is developed so far all members of class have used the default assess mode however this is not what you will typically want to be the case usually you will want to restrict assess to the data member of a class allowing assess only through methods all 
also there will be a times when you will want to define matter that are private to a class begin a member of declaration statement so let's better understand with the example program so let's see the program here is any first so this is the program so here you can write inside private method so it's a here is a class first private int my private and private void private method we are not using here package because we will discuss about package in a coming video so if we are using the, it's a, so declare a private member use a private keyword in its declaration so we are using a private word in declaration so object of class first can assess or modify my private variable and can invoke private method object of other than class first cannot assess or modify my private variable and cannot invoke private method okay so i think this with this example you can better understand so if we say ki private private protected public and package four hours assess specifier then see another example here this is also the example of ss specifier so we can uh, class alpha private int my private boolean is equals to first another object and uh, if this private then this it so it is showing error because we, we uh, commented the package to make you understand i am using this so this is a better program to understand about private so we already see uh, in student class about the protected so let's and pub about public you already knew about it so 